Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Lexi. Today I'm going to show you what I got our three boys for Christmas. So we have Oliver, who is six, Henry, who is three, and Samuel, who is one. So we do tend to stay a little bit more minimal for Christmas just because we have so many family members that also buy them gifts. Um, but I feel like they got some pretty solid pieces of stuff from us this year and some things that they really wanted. So in this video, I'm going to include everything we got for them, um, as well as their stocking stuffers. Now, in addition to these gifts, they also get like their advent calendars, but we just do the little chocolate ones. And then they also get a new set of Christmas PJs on Christmas Eve and we all match. So that sort of counts into part of their gifts. Um, so I'm going to start with Samuel first, I guess. So like I said, he's one, um, he's almost a year and a half. Um, not quite though. So I got them each a book, which is just part of their gift. So I got him this book called When God Made the World. I just thought the illustrations were so pretty and it just sounded like such a fun and exciting story, but also incorporating Jesus into it. And then his like big gift from us. Um, so we kind of do like one gift from Santa, which is what boys pick. It's the one toy that they get to really ask for. Um, and then the rest of the stuff is stuff that my husband and I want to get them or stuff that they need. But obviously he can't really tell me what it is he wants. So I just picked something that I thought he would like. Um, it's going to be kind of hard to show, but it's this kid craft fishing cooler thing. So it comes with this little grill. We have some other wooden play food and he plays with it a lot. So I thought this would be something really fun, but also outdoorsy for him. And then the little cooler looks like a little like Yeti cooler and the lid comes off and it has um, like a little campfire that they can put together and a fishing rod and fish they can catch and little cooking accessories. Um, I'll try to link everything below and if I can I'll put a picture up over here of what this looks like um, online because it'll be easier to tell what it is but those are his that's his big gift and then I'll just show you the one gift we got for all three boys um, it's sort of like an heirloom keepable keepsake gift um, my oldest son has been asking for a bow and arrow for so long but I'm not quite ready to get him a real one yet, uh, although I'm not really opposed to it, but Busy Puzzle on Etsy, I've ordered from them before, had these ones that they can use indoor and it won't hurt them or anything else. So I got one for each of them. This is Henry's. It's just the one I pulled out. I have their name engraved and has like a shoestring or a, like an elastic-y thing as the string. And then these little arrows just have little wool balls on the end. And I got a set of like 20 arrows, I think. But they each got one of these. The little arrow just slides in there and hooks on. And I think they're so cute. And it'll be such a fun keepsake for them as they get older. And then, oh, to go with those, I got each of the boys a little fake raccoon skin hat from Bass Pro Shops. I think they're like $9. Um, like I said, I'll try to link that below. Um, those are all of his like opening gifts. He has so many toys that were handed down to him also. and He's not really going to understand if he doesn't get a lot this Christmas. So um, his stocking stuffers, I got him this book, but not the hippopotamus. He has a ton of the Sandra Boynton books and loves them. And this is one that I used to read when I worked at a daycare and I think it's so cute. He has the, um, but not the armadillo one, which sort of ties into this. And he brings it to me like five times a day to read. So that's one of his stocking stuffers, and I got him these little munchkin stackable boats. Um, he just needed some new bath toys. And then this has another cool little gift. They're little stacking dolls, but they're little woodland animals. So this one's a bear, uh, a fox, an owl, and a bunny. And they're all wood. So I thought that would be another fun keepsake gift and then the last thing for his stocking are these two little trucks um it's a little bulldozer and a steamroller these were like two dollars each at target i think um so yeah that is all we got for samuel next i'll do henry 
so his book is Happy Like Soccer. He is absolutely obsessed with soccer. He's counting down until next year when he's actually able to play on a team in our area. Um, but this book also teaches how to like manage some emotions, it seems like, with it. So I thought he would really enjoy that. And then his big gift that he, big gift, it was like not that expensive, but that he asked for were these glow-in-the-dark trucks and cars. He carries trucks and cars, these monster trucks especially, with him absolutely everywhere he goes. Like we have to pack them for church, we have to pack them for the car. So when he saw this glow set, I snagged it and I'm glad I did because it seems like one of those toys that now that I got it, I can't find it in store or online anywhere. So if I can, I'll link it down below, but he's going to be so excited when he opens this. And then the last big gift I got him other than his bow and arrow is this monkey balance board. This is another one that was kind of hard to find. And when I did order it, it took like almost a month to get here. But he is very uh, sensory seeking. Um, we've been working with him on it, but it's really hard for him to find ways to manage his energy indoors. So I thought this would be really fun for him. And my family's getting him and Logan's family, my husband, is getting him a lot of things to sort of um, get his energy out inside. I know like my dad's getting him a mini trampoline, my mom's getting him a crawling tube, and I think um, my in-laws got him a little ball to bounce on, so he should be able to get plenty of energy out. And then his stocking stuffers, he absolutely adores fuzzy socks. So I found this pack at Target, one's just gray and white stripes, and one's gray and white tie-dye, so he'll get those. And then I got this pack of um, card games at Target for kids, they were actually in the party favors I think. But it had six little kid card games, and I split them between his and Oliver's. So in his, he'll get Goofish, a matching game, and a memory game. And then the last thing, and I'm going to take this out of its box and put it together, but they're little stacking dinosaurs that he can stack in different ways. And as long as the weight's distributed, they'll stand. Oh, it's not dinosaurs, it's animals. Regardless, he will really enjoy that. So that's all Henry got from us. And the last is on to Oliver. He got a few more smaller things that sort of equaled up to the total amount of Henry's balance board. But um, I will show you guys. This is his book, uh, The Atlas of Adventures. So it shows like interesting things all around the world. And he really likes books like this. Um, we have a lot of like DK publishing books and he really enjoys like looking at encyclopedias. So does Henry really, but that's his book. And then his big gift that he really wanted was this set of snap circuits. He is very like steam STEM minded and loves fidgeting and putting things together. So he saw that and picked that out and he can also get a lot of add on kits for that. Um, in addition to that, I know my family's getting him some more of the Hexbug Nanos, which he really enjoys. Um, the next thing he got is this little Lego kit. We have a good amount of Legos already. He plays with them a lot. Um, but he had just picked this set out for a friend, for his friend's birthday. And he was like, oh man, I really wish I had that one. So I got two and he didn't know. And so he'll get one on Christmas. And then... Really his last thing, he has his bow and arrow too, obviously. I got him at the Dollar Tree for a dollar each, two more sketchbooks he draws all the time. And then on Amazon, I ordered this pack of 40 markers. So it has really every color he could want. So um, yeah, that's what he got. And then for his stocking, he got the other three card games that came in that set. So he got Crazy Eights. Um, old Maid and Slapjack. And then I got him a little wallet. It's just, it was like, I think six or seven dollars on Amazon. Um, he is starting to get into things at school where he gets to take money and buy things himself. And um, I wanted him to have something that he could hold that in. Um, and this one, I did look for this, has the zipper pocket for loose change also. And then I got these at Bass Pro Shops. And they are nature river tubes. He has a lot of toy animals that he plays with, but he doesn't have most of these. So he'll be very excited about that. 
And then the last thing was just a pack of Pokemon cards. So that is all I got are three boys for Christmas. I hope that this helped you out and gave you some inspiration for your kids. I'm sorry my cat is meowing in the back. I will try to link as much as I can down below in the bio section. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you guys have wonderful holidays.